How's it going everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to properly upload files to your SiteGround domain. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do it is quite simple. And the first thing that you guys need to do is you want to make sure that you're logged into your SiteGround account as an administrator. And assuming that you guys have the uh, right permissions as an admin or a manager for your domain and website, you should be able to do this no problem. So once you guys are on the dashboard, you basically want to follow this path right here. So it goes site tools, site, and then file manager. So normally this would be under the uh, file manager tab, as you can see here. Well, I actually start with the site tab first. And then when you guys click on the drop down, you have three options being uh, configuring your S SQL files, FTP accounts, or so file transfer protocols, as well as the file manager. So what we're looking for here is the file manager. So what you guys need to do is you need to click on file manager and it should take you to this page right here. So this is what the folder looks like, or I should say the page. And when you guys go to upload um, files to your site ground, it could be like TXD files or uh, DMARC records or PHP files, whatever. You're met with two options, being uploading in an individual file, as you can see here, or you can upload an entire folder. So either way, it's up to you guys what you want to choose, but you want to basically click on this, these two buttons right here to upload the files and show you guys what I mean. You get to configure each file too by highlighting on it, right clicking, and you can either edit it, move it, archive it, download, or set the permission so that only certain people within your account can access it. So yeah, that's how you guys do it. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all of that said, thank you all for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.